Here's your word for the day from Calvary in Lake Havasu. Visit us on the web at calvaryaz.com. Good morning, Calvary. Have you ever seen the internet meme that says, if I won the lottery, I'd never tell anyone, but there would be signs? We're going to explore that concept today as we dive into Philippians 2, verses 12 and 13. Therefore, my beloved, as you have always obeyed, so now not only is in my presence, but much more in my absence. Work out your own salvation with fear and trembling, for it is God who works in you both to will and to work for his good pleasure. So here, what Paul is talking about is work out your own salvation with fear and trembling. But what does that mean? Well, let, let me put it to you like this. If you won the lottery, okay, there would obviously be signs. Your lifestyle would probably drastically change, okay? Well, we have won the lottery, except really we've won the eternal lottery. We get to spend eternity with God in, in heaven. And uh, if you are part of God's family and you've won the lottery of salvation, what Paul's challenging to you to do here is to work out that salvation externally so that people know that there might be some signs that you've won the lottery, okay? Earlier in Philippians, it's talking about God's made a promise that you're secure. That he will elevate you if you humble yourselves before, before men and you put others before yourself like Christ did. And if we do that as we work out our salvation, God's going to bless us and there will be obvious signs in our life that something is drastically different. So today, what I want to challenge you to do is work out that salvation. God's given you an incredible gift and it's up to you what you're going to do with it. Have a great day.